Hi everyone, Zori Moore here. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is a vlog. I just spent the afternoon visiting my favorite stores around San Francisco and I decided to create a video out of it. I know many of you are here for the Cezanne part, but make sure to stick around and watch the Madewell footage because their new collection is really, really good. Before we start, in the description box below, you're gonna find a few useful links. One, my Facebook group on there, I share discount codes, sale alerts, restock alerts, new collection gossip, and brands I think you're gonna like if you like my Cezanne content, my Instagram account, I have two actually, one dedicated to travel and one to personal style. If you're active on those platforms, please stop by and say hi. If you enjoy watching today's video, give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Consider subscribing. I would love to see you around more. Now let's get into today's video. Here I am at the Cezanne store again. Surprise, surprise. I had a return that was right at the two weeks mark. And I figured if I mail it back, it will probably take up to two weeks to see my refund. And a cool thing you can do at the store if you're planning to shop again is you can request store credit, which shows up on your account immediately. You don't have to wait for any processing. So you can use that same money towards your new purchase. I was really glad to see a few of the mellow bags in stock. It's the first time I'm seeing this pink. It's such a gorgeous color. They had the yellow one, which reminds me of Easter and of spring. And they had the green, which is my front runner along with the white currently, but they didn't have the white in stock. Here is me wearing the green mellow. I like it. The shade of the green is more minty. I wouldn't say it looked good with this jacket but I can imagine it with a few other things it will be really cute and here is the pink which happens to look really good with this jacket but I just feel like it's a little bit too bright I won't wear it quite as much as I was browsing the store I saw the Cassie shirt and it is really gorgeous I wanted to show it to you because look at this detail it's stunning and what I really love about it is that the back also has embroidery sometimes pieces like this only have detailings at the front but this one is a 360 sensation I've been wondering about this patchwork jacket they had it in stock so I threw it on I think the patchwork is beautiful I love the colors but one thing I did not like about this jacket is the fact that it doesn't really have pockets and I feel like it really needs it. I had to try the new padded skirt design. It is a true mini. It's very short and I had to size up. It runs really small. My usual size 34 did not fit. So this here is a 36. It's cute, but I'll pass on it. The store offered cafe and croissants, which was a really nice touch. I was really looking forward to visiting the Madewell store. I browsed their spring collection online and the size of my cart was ridiculous. I think over a thousand dollars worth of product. So I figured if I pop into the store that will help me make some decisions. I'm a big fan of their leather tote bags. They're really beautiful and this season you will find this similar weaving leather technique into smaller bags like this green one is beautiful and they have this cobalt blue that's really a great statement. This floral vest already sold out online twice but Madewell keeps restocking it. I think it's perfect for spring. It adds that sweetness to your outfit. It's really cute without being too childish and they are really in right now. This jacket is not on the website just yet but I'm gonna add a link to the jacket section because it should be in stock any moment. It's cropped, it's really lightweight and I adore how it's lined with this pattern on the inside with lighter colors. So fun. Then you have this maxi skirt. I wanted to show you an up close look. It's kind of like a gray. It's like a blue grayish with beige flowers and a very little touch of this yellow green that you see on the jacket. It's so soft, it drapes really, really well. And you can see here, it looks so cute with the jacket. Overall, 
I think the spring collection of Madewell, it's really made so every piece goes with every other piece and I'm a huge fan of that. This season we see oversized shirts everywhere. This one reminded me of the Max shirt by Cezanne. If you're looking for something on the lower price point with a little bit thicker cotton, this is a great piece. Before I left for Thailand in January, I got these same shorts but in khaki green and I ended up wearing them a lot. I really like them. They're comfortable. They are a good length. Your booty is not going to be hanging out. And this new yellow color matches everything else in the collection. Here I'm showing it to you with the flower vest and a really nice monochrome vibe if you pair it with the jacket. The denim by Madewell is one of my favorite. This is the boot cut kick out design. I already own two pairs but I don't have a row hem in this design so I'm considering these. If you like vintage you'll probably like this dress. It's a mini very comfortable material. It fits really well, looks very effortless. The colors are perfect for spring and summer. It is a short mini dress, but if you're on the market for something like this, this is a good option. Next, I popped into J. Crew. It was not a long store visit because the downtown San Francisco location is a bit sad. They don't stock the full collection, but they had this shirt which has been in my shopping cart for about two weeks now and I wanted to show it to you. It also comes in black and white, really soft cotton, beautiful detailing and on most days you can grab it from the website at 40% off. J. Crew often collaborates with Liberty London. This is one of the fabrics from that collaboration this season. I love the softness. Blue and yellow is such a classic combination. This fabric is used for dresses and different top designs. I've been seeing black and white gingham everywhere on the internet this season. It's a really easy print to work into any closet. I like the ruffle. It's around the neck, along the buttons and on your wrists. It really doesn't add any extra volume, maybe a little bit, but it's easy to work with this type of volume. I like it. My visit to the Reformation store was completely unplanned. I actually have been trying to avoid it because pretty much every time I go in, I like something and I have a lot of dresses that I'm trying to manage for the upcoming warmer weather. I love this new print I call it the hydrangea although the flowers are really abstract and I'm not sure if that is hydrangea indeed but it's really pretty. Reformation does linen dresses really really well. I tend to go for the ones that are not as form-fitted at the bottom like the one that I'm trying. I love the designs without the very deep slits the detailing, the slicing is so understated, but undeniably very feminine. Currently, I'm looking for something with a pattern, but they did not have this design with a pattern on in the store. However, I had to try it. I mean, it's so beautiful. Now, the print on this top reminds me of a very delicate porcelain cup. I really would love to try this in a dress form. The top is nice too, but I just will need a very high-waisted pen to tuck it in. This is my favorite print of the pieces that I've tried. And I wish I could take this print and paste it on the first white dress design. In fact, I looked on their website and they do have a version in this print that has all the qualities that I'm looking for. And I will have to order that one online and try it because the store doesn't carry it. But it is my front runner. All right, everyone, this is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below what do you think of today's vlog. 
which pieces were your favorite i want to know if you enjoy watching give this video a thumbs up it really helps my channel consider subscribing i'd love to see you around more have a wonderful week and see you next time